Today I have for you DBD's most terrifying Myers build, tier 4 Insta Mori Myers with no terror radius. I also play this on indoor maps to make it even scarier, and I even have a couple of other builds in this video which aren't as scary but are just as powerful, and I even have a build that turns Myers into one of the strongest killers in the entire game. I really hope you guys enjoy. Alright, let's go, let's go, let's go. Honestly, it might be good to stay downstairs at the beginning. I have a nice 3 gen over there as well. Nice. Trying to get tier two. Oh, and he's my, oh my God. He's the guy I need. Oh, perfect, perfect, perfect. We are farming this guy for stacks right now. Hello, friends. This is us. Okay. Just run for me. Good man. Good man. All right. Let's go. We got our nice old three gen. Now let's go farm someone else for the stalk. Meg's looking nice and juicy for the stalk here. Oh, no. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. That's it. That's it, Meg. That's it. Hells, yeah. Noish. Good old Megalodon. Are you fully stalked? You are fully stalked. All right, bet. Oh, they're both here. Oh, this is beautiful. And you can stalk them through these railings too. Oh my God. Oh, it's just, it's just so beautiful. It's just so beautiful. It's just too perfect. Oh, well done. Nice pathing. She almost got away from us there. Oh, she's so close. Oh, I'm playing with your food three stacks, dude. You are not getting away from me. Oh, that's it. That's it. Now we start. Now every time I kick a gen, I have no terror radius. Oh my god, it's gonna be so stupid. Hello, sir. Oh my god. I didn't even need the no terror radius for this one. I just came out of nowhere. He definitely could hear my terror radius. Give that a kick. Now we have nowhere to hide and no terror radius. This is probably the most terrifying thing in the entire game. I'm not gonna lie. They're hiding, dude. These guys are good at hiding. My terror radius is on that gen over there. These guys have no clue where I'm coming from. Hello there. I'm gonna try something crazy. You guys ready? No, I tried it. I was gonna try and grab her midair with the Mori. Oh my god, I did it! I actually managed to get it to work! Oh my god, that's so sick. I've never seen that before. Morying someone over the hole is insane, dude. No way! They're actually getting gens in. Okay, okay. It's okay, we have three gens now. This is what we need, because it's, it's a very low amount of gens to hold. There's only two of them left. There's no way these guys are getting out of here, bro. They should be over here, right? In this corner? I reckon they're down here and like to my left. Yeah, I heard them, I heard them breathe. I heard them breathe. Fake coming this way. Coming this way. Light of nowhere. Fake it. Come back. Dead. Oh my god. It worked. Let's go. We can hear them breathing in the corner. Oh my god. Okay, one last guy. I mean, this game wasn't very good for like the no terror radius. So we'll try that again on Larry's. Oh my. This is just the perfect match for DVD. Dude. What is going on? This was such a great game. This must be so terrifying for the survivors. I'm not gonna lie. They did get some gens done though. They, they got four gens done, which is kind of insane. Oh my God, I see the scratch marks. Dude. Wait, I'll fake going this way. Follow around this way so that she's under the corner. Imagine this was the achievement. We would have got the achievement first try. That is actually insane. Okay, let's do this again, but on Larry's with no terror radius on an indoor map. And let's actually do Trail of Torment this time. All right, let's go. So not only are we trying this, but we're also at a race against time because my mac and cheese is in the oven, okay? And it's, it's gonna pop in like 15 minutes. Oh my God, she's my obsession. Oh my God, yes, please. Run in front of me again. Oh my God, this is, this is a great start. This is it. This is gonna be so much more terrifying though than last game. Larry's is the most terrifying map for survivors. No, where's the Yui? No, I lost her. 
Okay, this is perfect. We'll juice up on Stalk on the thing. She is maxed out. Yep. Yeah. Okay, let's go back. And we have Corrupt here so that we have a 3 gen. And I've actually switched my perk to Ultimate Weapon instead of Nowhere to Hide because Distortion doesn't counter this. That's the plan. Okay. Get a couple seconds on you. And you have a lot of stalking to be done, madam. Oh my god, I almost already have tier 3. This is great. And you, a bit more on you. Let's actually kick this for trail for now. And try and make a little funny play. Oh, wait, he's right there. Stalk him. Nice. Trail of Torment. Nice. She didn't know I was coming. Give me that stalk. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. We're almost there. And there's our last stack as well. Oh, my God. It's happening. It's happening. Oh, it's so happening. Please be on this gem. Someone's on it. It's the Yui. Alright, that's it. That's it. That's it. Oh my god, this is so good. Oh my god, she didn't hear me. I don't think I was Shrill of Tormented, was I? I think she was cooking her mac and cheese. Oh yeah, that reminds me. I gotta be quick. Look how insane of a 3 gen we have, by the way. And they're trying to pop it. Oh, that's perfect. And then we wait. We fake going this way. Oh my god, Quinton. Nah, I don't get that. I mean, I probably do, but he makes the window. That's the thing. I don't want to kill him. I want to be perma tier 3. Wait, is that Yui? Oh my god, it might be Yui. Oh my god, it is. It is. She doesn't know I'm coming. Hello there. It is me. The tier 3 Michael with the tombstone. I can't imagine how terrifying this is to verse. I'm not going to lie. Wait, does the other guy not realize I'm right here? Brother? 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 Brother. You're dead too. It's too easy. I'm going to be able to play another game before my mac and cheese at this rate. Oh my god, hello. Hello there. Hello there. Oh my god, and they have calm spirit too, right? Wait, you're just dead. Yeah? Wait, right here. Hello there. No, it didn't give me the option to kill. Oh my god. Okay, I tried, I tried, I tried. I'm gonna do something really, really evil. <sighs> Guys, please forgive me, okay? Please forgive me, for I have sinned. I'm sorry, guys. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, Fang, I'm sorry. I'm sorry, Fang. Don't comment hate comments, okay? I promise I'll be nicer to the next survivor. All right, let's go. We're back on Larry's. I'm gonna do this one more time because this has just been so much fun. I do have two other builds I really wanna show you guys as well. There's a way to make Myers an S tier killer. Obviously, you know, this makes him look pretty good, but against really good survivors, this isn't great because really good survivors will hold W far away from you and stop you from getting a lot of like stalk like this you see how the survivors are kind of giving me the stalk an insanely good survivor with like you know a lot of experience won't allow me to do this what i'm doing right now i'm a bit of stalk on you and then we need to find the other kate the one with the obsession it might be this girl yep there she is that's the one i can farm my three player with the food stacks i also have a build to make maya's vault windows like before he even presses Hello. space bar he's through the window which is like insane You'll see what I mean when we do it. And so we're going to be doing those builds as well in this video. Because I just think they're really fun. Let's farm this. Yeah, man. Okay, almost fully stalked. Wait, I didn't get another stack. Hold up. Let me farm you, madam. I was going to say, the, uh, the entering chase has been really buggy, I think. We'll do this. Break the pallet this way. We should lose the chase right here. And then we'll follow one more time. Quickly get the stack here. There we go. We have to follow her just a second. And now leave. Stalk for just a sec. Nice. And then over here on the shen, there should be people. Beautiful. We're so close.
Oh yeah, Claude's gonna feed me it here. Oh yeah, that's it. Good stuff. Let's get Trail of Torment. And let's pop the stair three. Hello there. I am now the no terror radius. Perma tier four Myers with instant tombstone and perma tier three. And I'm also undetectable with no terror radius. Let's do this. Let's not even go for her. Let's leave. And these guys on the gen won't even know I'm coming back because I don't have a terror radius. Hello there. Oh my god. This is so stupid. We can try and down this girl, but honestly, I want all my kills to be undetectable kills. Okay. Oh, you know what's really funny? I need this locker to get my ultimate weapon. I'm actually just going to do this and put you right in the middle of my three generators here. You're going to help me get my next Mori by just being on that hook. Thank you. This Claudette might actually have Calm Spirit. Yeah, she does. Oh, I almost got it. No, I lost a stack for that. Wait, I'm still undetectable though. Hello there. No, I lost another stack. It said M1 to kill. It didn't let me. Wait, I can, I can kill this girl, can't I? I actually can, I think. Oh my God, wait, they're on my gen. Hello there. Oh, and I actually got a stack for that because I lost chase with her. And there's the other girl too. Oh my God. This is so perfect. I do want to jump scare these last couple though. Do this, poor Kate. Oh my God. I'm going to kick this one for trail and go back over here to the, these ones. Pretend like I'm coming for this Kate here. No terror radius right now. Sneak up on this guy. Hello there, Kodat. How are you doing? Oh my god. All right. I think we've proven that this build is disgusting and really catches people off guard. Let's find this last girl with our no terror radius. Don't get the hatch. Hello, guys. Oh, hello there. I'm going to fully cut her off. She doesn't know I'm right here. Hello. Oh my god. It's just too good. It's just way too good. Okay. We're going to go now to Volt Speed Myers. And then at the end of the video, I'm going to show you guys a build to make Michael Myers an S tier killer. All right, let's go. First things first, you might be wondering, Aaron, why do you not have fire upon? And this is why. Watch the speed at which I stalk this Claudette on the bottom left. Look at the speed I'm gaining. My tier two, my tier three. And that is because I didn't want to do infinite tier three for this build just because it feels a little bit cheese. And I wanted to do a build that's a bit more realistic at high MMR against good survivors. Look how quickly I get tier three up. Look at that, I already have it. And so we still have vault build, but it's not as good as it could be. We also have coup de grace. Life, no life, okay, nice. We can, we can kill it here. Nice. So this Claudette is our key to winning the game. We stalk her so quickly. It's not even funny. She starts us off with a really quick down. And we have a five gen setup around main building, actually. Okay. I kind of wanted him to go vault main window. Oh, I did not mean to do that, but that's okay. Alan? Are you awake, sir? What is going on? Oh, hello. Does she know I'm stalking her? Probably not. And then let's use this Claudette again for the super stalk. We're almost all used up on her too, though. We almost have a second tier three already. Okay, there we go. Thank you. Finding her early game with Luther Basu was so good, I think. I think that was so smart. Oh, wow. Well played. Almost. I still get her, though. And dead. But yeah, three hooks already at five gens on Michael Myers is actually insane. Like, this is not normal. You're not supposed to be able to get tier three that quick. And you definitely are not supposed to be able to get downs that fast with Michael Myers. And you know what's really funny? This build might make Michael look good. But next game, I have a build that literally turns Michael into an S tier killer. You guys will see. It's almost unescapable, if I'm being honest with you. Alan, wake up. Oh yeah, 
Oh, that's gonna be tier three again. That's gonna be tier three again in no time. Oh, yep. Zarina realized it too when she saw me. Hello. Ooh, off the record, okay. I know everyone's been using that ever since it's glitched. Obviously, not everyone. This girl's playing Zarina, so. But a lot of people are using that because there's currently a glitch at the moment where if you mend, you keep your off the record. Nice. You don't keep your off the record, sorry. What I meant to say is you keep the endurance effect. So if you mend, you keep endurance. And because off the record lasts so long, you just keep your endurance for the whole time until like the actual perk runs out. So if you just keep mending and taking hits people, you can take multiple hits with it. Hello there. Oh my god. I think I've fully stalked Claudia anyway, so even if she does end up dying, that wouldn't be too bad. We actually lost tier three. Decisive strike, okay. Oh yeah, give me that, Claude. Nice. As much as you can, please. And then you, Zarina, you're almost dead, so... I would like to, uh... I wouldn't say milk, but maybe farm you for another tier 3. I like popping it on injured people. I enjoy it quite a lot. We're still at four gens! Honestly, when that gen popped, I felt pressured. As if the game was going to be ending soon. But that's absolutely not the case. We only just got our first two coup de grace stacks, actually. Let's see. I see her. She tried sneaking past me. She's gonna taste coup de grace so hard here. Wait for it. Hide ourselves. She went shack. Oh my god. Can you imagine? Wait, I have an idea. Imagine? Now nah, there's no way. Wait, there's no way. We mind game her. Oh my god. I'm not tier 3, but we did actually mind game her. That's so funny. Okay, we'll take an M1. Wait, that used my coup de grace stack. Oh, you're fully stalked. Let's actually go for her. She's injured. We have coup stacks again. Now. Nice. I think that might be a kill as well. It is. Okay. Give that a good old kick. Hello, Alan. Oh my god. Yep. We're gonna be in an endgame in a second here. Nice. Is he gonna pop it? Wait. He hasn't popped it. Okay. It's not over yet. Yeah, I'm gonna catch up in no time here. Oh my god. Tier life. We just gotta win this my game. Beautiful. And then let's finish off the game. Alan Wake should be on the shin, if I'm right. Don't pop it. I need that result for my, uh, my DVD tournament. I could've killed him there, but I kinda wanna make him go towards a window. Go that way. Yeah, go to that jungle gym. Perfect. Okay, here we go, here we go. I can't stalk him, but that's fine. Kiss me. Hello, Alan. <laughs> okay, go towards some windows, good sir. I want to hit you with the window special. I'm going to try and hide myself so he doesn't know where I'm going. Hello, good sir. She did not want to be found. She was on the edge of the map. I don't usually show endgame chats like this, but this guy was really, really wholesome. He said, I'm speechless. You did hella good as Myers, which is kind of funny because he is actually one of the lowest tier killers in the entire game. All right, let's go. So we need to find Michaela off spawn. Is this? That's her. We already, oh my god. I really am going to be able to show you guys how strong this build is due to the fact that we found Michaela in three seconds. Like this is probably as strong as it gets. Actually, I should get tier two quick. Just so I can be a little bit faster again. So then I can catch up faster. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, here we go. We'll catch up in just a moment here. And then we stalk. Let her leave chase by stalking. And then we catch up again. Okay, there we go. And that's three stacks. And let's go straight to main with our three stacks and farm our tombstone in literally five seconds on any survival we want. 
Go for you. Double back here. Follow this way. Come around there. She's using Sprint Burst. 99. Let's follow through. We will be able to keep up with her no matter what she does. And... There we go. Farm our tombstone. Oh my god. Okay, I lost a play with the food stack. Wait, Michaela? No. You wouldn't. Do I leave her? Keep her for play with your food? Yeah, I do. I do. I do. I can end her right there, by the way. Just so you guys are aware. She is in a dead zone on the edge of the map. That is a kill, okay? I'm gonna leave her for the pure fact that I know I can kill someone else just as quick. Yeah, that is just kind of broken. The fact that this exists in the game and you can get kills faster than you can with Nurse, Blight, anything. It doesn't matter who it is. If you run Lethal Pursuer with Play With Your Food off spawn and you run Corrupt and Deadlock to stop them from being able to pop gens quick enough, there's basically nothing the survivors can do. Oh wait, what am I doing? And by the way, you can tombstone two people with this. You can almost tombstone three, I think, but I'm not 100% sure. You might be able to. It depends how like efficiently you kill the people who you've stalked. Hold this window. He's in a run locker. You're dead. Goodbye. And now I don't actually have to play the game to tombstone people anymore. I can now actually just play the game normally if I want, because guess what? It's a 2v1 with three gens left. The fact that the devs have left this build in the game this long is crazy to me. I do understand the red tombstone, but the tombstone piece is ridiculous. Like this is the craziest add-on in DVD. Like it's, it's not even funny. Okay, I'm definitely not gonna be able to get another tombstone. So we'll just go for normal chases now. We've got our play with your food stacks. Go for normal chases. And we can obviously end the first normal chase instantly due to the fact that we have play with your food stacks once again. Yeah, the idea of this is just crazy to me. And then let's find the last survivor and get this game over with. I hear a breathing. Yep, do a little, little bang. And then I'm not going to slug. I'll just put him up. A little showcase of, of Myers being an S tier killer, which honestly is kind of crazy that you can even do this still. This has been in the game for a very, very long time as well. Let's see. Maybe we can stalk him. No, we, we definitely cannot. All right. Well, GG's. Oh, oh, the plot twist. It's not over yet. It's not over yet. Beautiful. We're not slugging, remember? So pick this up. She has a flashlight. That's why I faced away. Put you up, go for Fang one last time. Right here. You can hear her. Beautiful. Oh, wait, she actually had Dead Heart. I can see that. GG's. Damn, well played. All right, well, I hope you guys enjoyed this little showcase. I really hope you guys enjoyed the video. And uh, yeah, I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace out.